Hey guys, so uh, I got some new babies and I wanted to show you. Um, this is like, I don't want her crawling in that. She likes to go that direction. But this here, I just picked her up. Um, if you're following my Twitter or my Instagram, you've seen pictures of them already. I just got them a couple days ago. My hair is getting in my mouth too. That's wonderful. Anyway, this is, oh, I'm sorry, I did a startle. This is, we've dubbed her Neo. So this is Neo. She's my female. And she's from a 2018 clutch. Uh, at least that's what I was told. She's not a, a terrible size either. I mean, she's, I can get her to stretch out. She, she was stretching out earlier, but. She's got some length on her for being, I think, what, almost a year? Maybe. Anyway, um, she is a normal, obviously, but she's het clown. So she's a normal het clown. And when she gets old enough, she's going to be part of my breeding project. Because I am going to show you another little guy here in a minute. If I can get her to not try to wander off on me. She's she's an adventurer. She's been trying to get into literally, literally everything. And I do mean everything. Come here, you. Can you sit on my, can you sit here for a second, please? No? Okay. Don't, just don't go, don't go on the floor. And uh, so this little guy here apparently likes to sit in my lap. And just chill. This is Roman. I'm going to disturb him for a second so I can show you. There. So, no! What are you doing? Neo! Why do you do this? This is why I... No! No! Oh my. She's trying to go down the... Neo! Ah! Oh. No, don't blab at me. Anyway, Neo's being a little butt. She's trying to get into everything. But this little dude, I'm gonna hold him up. He's been sitting in my lap. He likes to sit in my lap. He doesn't really like, doesn't really budge much. But uh, if you can tell, the lighting. Oh, I scared Neo. The lighting is a. Uh, a little darker, but you can tell his color. There, it focused on it a little. Can you see his head? Look. He's saying hi. Are you going to give him a blip? No. He's just poking his little snoot out. Say hi, Roman. Anyway, yes, his name is Roman. He's a pastel, as you can tell from the color and the pattern. He's got that. His pattern definitely looks a little busier. All right, now you're going to come out and say hi. And he is also a het clown from a different clutch, but he's also a 2018 hatchling. And what are you doing? He's, he's very upset because I moved him from my lap. Say hi. No blips? Okay. Yeah. But, um... Oh, there he goes. He's blipping. But, so these two are going to be my pairs. <clears throat> well, one of my pairs. I'm, I'm planning on having another pair, too. But they are, when they're old enough, which is going to be in the next, you know, few years, couple years, uh, they're going to be a pastel clown project for me, which is going to be my first project that will be successful because the project that I had before I was going to do Bumblebee, um, but unfortunately due to personal reasons and circumstances, when I moved, I had to give up all of my snakes and they were part of that pair and they had to, they had to go. So I gave them, uh, I gave them away 
and didn't actually get to see the, that, that project in fruition. So this is going to be my pastel clown pair. Oh, now you're going to come out and say hi. Uh oh, no, yes. He's such a dork. He, I don't know. I thought he was going to be the adventurous one. Because at first he was the one that was moving around a lot, but now it turns out this is my adventurous one. Neo is. Roman is like a couch potato. He's a couch potato baby. He likes to just chill in my lap, which is fine with me. But anyway, my next pair that I'm going to get that I already technically own, I just have to clean out the cages that I have and set them up is going to be a, um, the female is a super pastel, and the male is a pastel hidden Jean Woma. And he's got a beautiful pattern on him when I get them, when I actually bring them into the uh, house, I will do a video on them as well. But uh, these are my two new, new babies, my two new family members, Neo and Roman. And... Uh, so I know you're head shy. I'm sorry. They're still they're still pretty new. They're you know to adjusting to being held, and they don't like their hides for some reason. They aren't. I gave them their hides, temporary hides, um, <clears throat> and I'm gonna get them better ones. But like they won't use them. They just they look at like they go to the back of the cage and just chill out in the corner, which is fine. I mean if that's their preference and whatever. They were kept in tubs, so I'm sure they're not used to a hide because the tubs didn't have a hide. They just went to the back of the tub where it was dark. So they are apparently just going back to the cage where it's dark, and that's where they hang out. And so uh, I'm actually going to be resetting up an area for them because right now where they're at is in my back room, and my back room is not exactly the best place. It's not easily temperature controlled uh, so I'm gonna try to do something to make it a little better for them but um yeah so these are these are my two new babies that are gonna be a part of my project and when I get my new my other two I will show them off as well once I get my cage cages all set up um, I will also show you where I'll be keeping them uh, once they're not in a temporary place for now uh, just because I mean let's face it my back room is kind of a mess and I would just really rather them be in an area that's not a giant mess he's such a pretty color though like when I look at him in the light when you look at him up close He's that really pretty yellow that pastels can get, and his pattern is just, I don't know. I feel like she's a really pretty normal, too. I feel like her pattern is pretty, like, uniform, mostly. I've had normals that didn't look, you know, I've seen normals that didn't look quite so as bright as her. So, yep. Just wanted to introduce you to my new ones, my new babies, my new family members. Lit, really? Yeah, she does that. She likes to go up to my nose, like she thinks that she's gonna get get my nose or something. But thank you. I will see you guys later, and um, just be on the lookout. I'm gonna make another episode of my podcast. My first episode, I've decided it's going to be about, I'm going to give you a little bit more about me, and then I'm also going to uh, discuss ball pythons as a topic. So that's going to be my first, my first full episode that will not be completely scripted, because my intro was completely scripted, because it was just a short intro. I didn't want to do anything major, and I wasn't sure what to do, so keep a lookout for that. You can find that on anchor.fm slash... Happy Herps, and you can follow me on my Twitter, and you can follow me on my Instagram if you want to see just photos and updates of things that I'm going to be taking pictures of these little guys, 
and posting them on my Instagram and probably on my Twitter, let's be honest. And uh, eventually I'm going to do some streaming. I'm sure they'll be part of my streaming. Uh, I want to do some educational streams over on Twitch about reptiles and, and uh, gosh, I can talk. I swear I can talk. Ball pythons and pythons and snakes in general. So uh, you can check that out at uh, twitch.tv slash Valtheria. V-A-H-T-L-T-H-E-R-I-A. I can't even spell today, you guys. It's, it's that bad. And, um... So yeah, that's that's that. If you want to see more updates on YouTube about my snakes, go ahead and click the follow button, the little the follow button. Subscribe. You can hit the bell for the notifications. Um, so when I do upload, you will get notified. And what are you doing, you? Where are you going? What are you doing? She has no idea. What, she has no idea what she's doing. I will see you guys later. Thank you. Bye.